everybody, it's Rona. I am coming to you from Joann's, and I had actually followed Tim Holtz on his uh, CHA um, trip, and I wanted to show you, they have gotten some of the items in, but not all of them here at Joann's, and they do have a lot. I mean, look at all this. So I'm going to go through what I can remember as being new. Look at this, guys. Look how much there is. Um, let's see here. This right here, I believe, was new. Um, these are some of his new um, ideology ideology I can't say that word uh, quote bands right here and they do have these on sale this week 30% um, off so um, I believe these were still from his old line these are actually new um, these are actually he said that took that took him a long time to actually find these paper flowers that would actually take ink very well so I don't do know for a fact those for $4.99 and I'm just gonna go down this way um, they have already sold out of some of this stuff these words right here were new um, let's see, how many do you get in here? I was trying to see for you guys. There are 58 pieces in here. So that's a lot. And this is chipboard, guys. So this is not like lightweight. So that is new. Um, let's see. God, they've got so much stuff. I cannot believe how much they've actually gotten in. And if the camera actually goes um, a little out of the way, I apologize for that, guys. It's kind of hard to uh, film this and uh, look ahead at the same time. So these are actually new, his index clips. I did see that in his video. So there's some uh, crossbone adornments coming here. These are new. The stars. These are actually pretty heavy. I believe these are new. The forks and knives. I'm trying to make sure that you guys can see uh, the prices as well. These are new. These are all letters. Um, and they are not, I don't think, they're just transparent tiles. So you should be able to affix those um, with your Xyron. Okay, let's go down here. These are new. The little letters. Those were from last year. I'm trying to figure out what this is. Um, adornment treasures. Okay, so these are birds and um, there's like four leaf clovers and a dog in there. Those are really cute. Um, out of a couple of things here but I'm just again giving you guys a first look so you can see what to expect in your stores and keep an eye out for um, these right here are new these are brads with numbers on them uh, we have the arrows the uh, ink pen wells were from last year um, let's see here this is a repeat of these adornments. Somebody must have moved those. Um, these are new, these little letters. They don't look like much in the package, but once you get them peeled off and put onto whatever you're putting on it, they are absolutely beautiful. So he has those in silver and gold, and we're fixing to get into a lot of uh, ideology here. Um, like ephemera and items so that is I can't really get that down there so you guys can see what's in the package this one is new as well um, this is 54 pieces the last one was uh, 63 pieces um, this is a repeat I wonder if somebody accidentally stuck this yep someone stuck that over there so this is new the thrift shop Oop. Thrift Shop Ephemera package is new. And that is a total of 54 pieces for $4.99. And again, this stuff is actually on sale this week. Um, flip, flip frame, I can't say it. Flip frame <laughs> pockets. Good grief. I swear I'd been drinking this morning. But um, actually, this would make um, good, this is actually really good for shakers. My head's thinking before my mouth is there. Um, he's got colored twine out this year. Um, here are some. This is like 107 pieces. 
going to have to get down here, guys. Sorry, I can't bend like that. Uh, these are all of uh, vintage photos. Really cool. This is brand new right here. This is 83 pieces. Here's another one with 33 pieces. This has a lot of um, cards and type things in it. Um, I don't know how else to explain that, like bingo cards and uh, pieces of paper and things like that. This is actually, this is new here. I'll put pan back for you a little bit. This is actually wood pieces that you can use. So you get four piece that, pieces there. Now this is what I'm really excited about. Um, when he was at CHA, he was explaining this. These are actually just foam letters. And instead of making um, the cling stamps, he went ahead and opted to do this because it's a much af more affordable way of doing letters and, and stamps and things. So there are your lowercase uh, letters for $10.99. Here are your lowercase letters, again, just in a different type font. And these are clean guys. They're just foam. And they're your uppercase letters. Okay, let's go up here. Do this as gracefully as I possibly can. I believe this is new to Joanne's. I'm not sure if it's new to Tim Holtz or not. And then he had these last year. Um, yeah, okay, let's go down here. A bunch of chipboard pieces we have. It says random uh, for $6.99, 255 pieces. Uh, this is new to this Joann's. They did not have this. Uh, Hobby Lobby, I believe, carries this right here. And then, um, of course, we have the sander is back to Joann's, my Joann's. They got rid of them last year at mine. Here's some little letters here that is new. Um, this is actually kind of cute. Um, it is actually, yeah, it's fabric and it's wrapped around there. This is new to Tim Holtz. Washi tape, guys, for Tim Holtz, $9.99. So I saw that at CHA where he was showing all that. That was kind of cool. Uh, that was from last year. I'm trying to see if there was anything else from here. Not from here that aren't. Um, these are actually new finials for here. And then um, this is new. These little snippets it's called. Ephemera snippets where you get 111 pieces in that one. 111 pieces in this one. Those are cute. Great for guy cards. Okay, let's see here. Where am I going? I'm trying to see. Okay, so uh, this is new to my Joann's. And then this is new to Tim Holtz. He showed this at CHA. So those are $2.99 for 295 stickers. And then um, it looks like that's it for this. Now I'm going to go ahead. Uh, he does have these frames that you can actually put things on and in for $13.99. And I cannot remember, guys. We have some new um, paper stacks. And it's hard for me to show these because there's no way worth for me to put these. But um, I'm going to just flip through it real quick for you guys. This one is new to my Joann's. And this one is called French Industrial. So that's actually kind of pretty. I'm always looking for new stuff for guys. And that fits the bill right there. This is new to Tim Holtz. See how bright these colors are? That's actually new to Tim Holtz. Kind of a different feel a little bit for some of his stuff. I really like this stack. I mainly end up getting this stack just because it has more color to, in it. And then let's see what we have here. This is, uh, this is his old wallflower. And then this is new. This is um, just 36 pieces of paper called memor memorabilia. I cannot talk today. So let's take a quick peek at these. That's kind of pretty. 
Very easy to use for cards, that's for sure. And the paper feels really good, guys. When you go into your store, just feel that paper. It just, there's a different texture to it. It feels like very expensive paper. Okay, and then we have Wallflower, and then this is new to Joann's. I'm not sure if it's new to Tim Holtz or not. I can't remember everything that he was showing us through CHA. He had so many videos with new stuff that was coming out. And then there was this other thing I wanted to show you. They have this small one right here. This is called um, Etc. Yes, so this is new. I remember him showing this one. And this one here, uh, this is a craft stock. It's called Classics, but I can't open it. He has it closed, but you can kind of get this feel for this. Now, this is brand new. And I'm going to open this just really quickly because he said that this paper um, does need to be put back in the package as soon as you open it up because it's, it has a different kind of texture to it that has gone through the paper and it's not just a finish on top of the paper. I remember him saying that. But I wanted you guys to see it, so bear with me just a second. I'm going to pull the camera up a little bit so you guys don't have a blank. Okay, can you see that? It's mirrored. There's silver. It's kind of hard to see, I know, guys. There we go. That's silver. And there's the gold. So it looks mirrored, but it doesn't feel mirrored. Um, and again, he stated that when you use this, you need to put it right back into the package and not leave it open because the um, humidity in the air will actually... Um, do something to the paper, and I can't remember what he was talking about, but um, anyway, guys, I just wanted to give you guys a quick look. Um, he is coming out with some new um, inks that are, they are called dye dis, uh, oxide, I believe is what it is called, and he hasn't, they haven't hit this Joann's yet, but it will be within this mixture right here. Um, and anyway, guys, I just wanted you to get a quick look at was, what was coming your way. Um, Joann's is still working hard at getting all of the stuff from CHA within their stores. That's what the holdup is all the time, um, is like CHA is in February, and buyers have to go place their orders in March and get it to the... Um, or they place their orders in February, and they, they're trying to get everything on the shelves by March. So um, I hope that kind of explains things and uh, why things don't get in the store immediately. It's a long process for everybody to go through. So this is like the biggest Tim Holtz section that I think I've ever seen. And this is within a small uh, Joanne store. It isn't even a large one. It's small. We don't even have clink stamps at the store if that tells you how small it is. So anyway, guys, thanks for joining me and we will talk to you later. Bye-bye.